The Ministry of Social and Community Development, Housing and Gender Affairs took to the streets of St. Andrew on Thursday to sensitize the public on issues affecting the elderly. The march was part of the June 15th activities for World Elder Abuse Awareness Day, which was designated by the United Nations in 2006 to raise awareness on the issue. The sensitization march commenced at the Cook Hill Road area and concluded at the Grenville Car Park with a brief ceremony. The Minister of State with responsibility for social development and gender affairs, Honorable Gloria Thomas, was actively involved in the day's activity and spoke of the importance of the initiative. For us at the Ministry of Social Development, it is a very significant day because over the years and in more recent times, we have had a number of reports of abuse meted out to the elderly in communities by relatives, by caregivers, and people in general who interact with them. And I think part of the problem is that people don't understand aging and the elderly and the need for them to be a little bit more compassionate and understanding. And so for us at the ministry, we see today as a day where we could create that awareness, sensitize the public, and to get the indulgence in understanding and responding to the elderly in a more compassionate and humane way. Minister Thomas urged the public to value and protect the elderly as they are treasures in our society. The elderly is more or less holders of culture, of way of life, of traditions, and we need to really not share them. We really need to take care of them because they are the ones who will pass on to us the stories of yesteryear, the way of life, and bring to us some values that we still need to uphold and recognize in today's world. Oftentimes we hear they say we, that um, society is deteriorating or the fabric of society is in much shambles and it's because we are not following some of the traditions, the teachings, the guidance of the elderly. And I think they play a very, very important part in society and we should treasure them.